in this session we are going to discuss uh, lobe bump okay lobe bump is shown in uh, figure it uh, consists of uh, idler gear and another one is uh, driver gear okay it's having uh, one inlet port and uh, outlet port okay uh, in this uh, Pump the gear are placed uh, by the lobes. Okay, these uh, lobes operate uh, uh, in a similar uh, fashion as that of uh, external pump. Because uh, unlike the external gear pump, these both uh, lobes are uh, driven independently and uh, they don't have actual uh, contact with uh, each other. Okay, the lobe contact is prevented by uh, external. Uh, uh, timing gears located in the gear pump. Uh, pump and uh, pump shaft uh, support uh, bearings are located in the gear pump. So the bearings uh, are out of the pumped liquid. The pressure is limited uh, limited by uh, bearing location and uh, shaft uh, depletion. Okay. The liquid flow into the cavity and the trapped by the lobes as they rotate okay the liquid travels around the interior of the casting in the pocket between the lobe and the casting it does not uh, pass between the uh, lobes so uh, finally the missing of the lobe force uh, liquid through the outlet uh, port under the pressure so they are uh, quieter than other type of gear pumps uh, the low pump has a small number of uh, matting element uh, okay so the low pump output will have um, greater amount of uh, pulse heating uh, although its volumetric dis displacement uh, is uh, generally greater than for the other type of uh, gear pumps Lobe pumps are uh, frequently used uh, in uh, food application uh, because uh, they handle solid uh, uh, without damaging the products. Okay, so mainly the lobe pump is using in uh, uh, solid product applications. advantages uh, uh, past medium uh, solid and uh, no metal uh, to metal contact okay and uh, long term uh, uh, dry run okay these are the main uh, advantages of uh, low pump okay disadvantages of uh, low pump requires uh, timing gear and uh, requires uh, uh, two seals okay and uh, reduced uh, lift with uh, thin liquids okay these are the disadvantages of uh, low pump yes we are going to discuss the uh, major applications of uh, low pump okay. uh, first one is uh, paper coating uh, this uh, pump is mainly using for uh, paper coating and uh, uh, soaps and uh, surfactants, then uh, paints, dyes, uh, rubbers and uh, achieves, additives and uh, paramedicals. Okay, these are the uh, main applications of uh, low pump. But here uh, we are using the uh, gear uh, gear rotor uh, pump. Uh, gear rotor pump is uh, positive displacement pumping unit. Okay, uh, the name gear rotor is drive pump. The generated rotor. Okay, uh, this unit consists of an uh, inner and uh, uh, outer rotor. Okay. Uh, this is uh, the details about uh, gear rotor uh, pump. Uh, 